Hello, my name is Leo, and welcome to the 29th, Friday the 29th of Morning Star. What's well, actually t t t Titus? I think it's Tuesday in the world, but whatever, it's Friday for us. But why is, why is, I thought the date and the, the, no, no, it, it'll never be, because, um, there's only 30 days, remember, in Arena? So every month only has 30 days. Well, rather, every month has 30 days. So, the months and the dates will always be wrong. Ah, okay. Yeah. However, Persona 4, the days and the months, at least if we start the playthrough this year, which I will, in uh, in April, beginning of April, um, the days and the month, and the day and the date will match up perfectly. I think. Well, it should, because... Well, the only, the only thing, the only possible problem might occur February next year, which is like, you know, two months left in the, in the friggin, actually, no, I think the game ends on December 31st. Really? I think so. I think, well, I think, I think December 31st, it jumps to March. Oh. Because I know that Persona 3, I'm playing through Persona 3 right now, and um, the game could end. No, 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 you're thinking of Persona 3. The game could end on the 31st if you do one action. But then if you choose another action, the game continues on until January 31st. I'm, pre I'm pretty sure Persona 3, the Persona 4, sorry, the game jumps to. Um, yeah, I, I do remember hearing something about jumping to March. But I think Plan 3 probably will do that too, because generally, you know, the whole Japanese have this thing about March, or end of March, beginning of April, when the cherry blossoms bloom. That's like the beginning of the year. Beginning and ending of a year. Kind of. It's more like <clears throat> New Year's is like the end of the year, and then the cherry blossoms is the beginning of the New Year, so it's like three months limbo. <laughs> anyway. We are in the Temple of the Mad God, which is pretty, which is a pretty cool name for a god. Also, I'm shielded. Why is that? Don't you remember you used a shielding charge? Oh, that's right, to, to uh, repair it. Oh, that's cool. That's cool that that, that stays like that. Wait, what, what time was it? I don't know. Uh, let's save it here. Alright. Okay, so this could be a long episode, depending on whether or not I can find someone to sleep. Well, you know what? It's 10 o'clock at night, so it's not going to be that long. Oh. Let's make this jump. Oh, shit, there's a guy behind me. Hello. Hey, Mr. Skeleton. Hey, Mr. Skeleton's friend. Looks like I'm coming in here. What do you got, Skeleton? 36 pieces, thank you. Appreciate that. What about you, Mr. Skeleton? What do you got? Nothing. What a useless fucking skeleton. A useless bloody skeleton. So what are we here to do? We are here to find... Well, check your logbook. Oh. We're here to find a crystal or something. It doesn't actually say. But yeah, we're here to find a crystal. And if we find said crystal, he can protect his mages or whatever the hell he wants to do. And it'll also tell us where the crystal tower is. Because it's a magical item. And it harnesses its magical energies from the crystal tower. So that's, you know. Which, you know, makes the most sense out of all the other quests we've been given by lords and whatnot. Now, I don't... Oh, hello. Hey, Skelly. I don't have a, uh, a light guy, do I? No, you do not. I have full spot, I have healing, I've got opening, and it's sanctuary. Fantastic. I just realized why I'm not taking any damage, because I'm shielded. Is it, isn't it just because I'm awesome? No, it's because you're shielded. I don't really want to go this way. Well, don't go this way. I want to go the other way. I want to go this way. Because I like this, I like the... The floor. Ooh, ooh, that looks interesting. It does look interesting. Look at the jewels on that. That is deluxe. I'm going to say it again. 
That is a deluxe grave right there. I do say so myself. And I do. Oh, I do. So, I'm pretty sure I talked about this on uh, Sunday when I did the last episode. Uh, and I will talk about it in uh, should just play through it if I remember. Oh, I wonder if I can get up there. But you can. <laughs> no, you can't. It's a weird little thingy. It is a weird little thingy to have. Makes me think like enemies are going to drop down from it. Uh, but it snowed a bunch on Sunday, and, uh, I recorded it, I don't record the episode. You recorded it, like, in the afternoon. But it, it snowed, it started snowing a bucket load. Um, it was the most snow, I think I said this before, it was the most snow in my region, uh, in the last ten years. Like, the highest snowfall. That's pretty impressive. If a person that comes from uh, a city in Australia that it doesn't snow, that's a lot of snow there you got. <laughs> yeah, didn't really do anything though. I didn't like go out. I, I sort of, I sort of stood outside. I'm like, oh hey minerals. I kind of stood outside. I was like, oh yeah, this is nice. Uh, I don't want your dagger. Go away. What else you got? Nothing. Um, I'm like, oh, oh it's it's so it's so pretty. And I shoved my hand in a big pile of snow. It was all powdery and stuff. I'm like, oh, that's... Not what I... Why did you pick up that potion for? I'm just going to drink it. For, for no reason. Could be a healing item, you never know. Could be poison. I don't actually think there is poison. You, you... You're kind of thinking in the mindset of, um... What was that game on the, the Genesis? Fatal Labyrinth. Yeah. I think I've actually talked about that before, this game before. It was a game, was that a, was that a bona fide dead end? No, there's something there. You sure? Go back. No, there's not, that's just a little hidey hole. Okay, um, it's this like little RPG, was it Japanese? I don't know who made it. But I played it in my childhood. I never got anywhere in the childhood, but as an adult I got the game again and I played a bit of it and yeah, that game's hard. Like, you don't know what anything does. Um, there are, like, identifying scrolls, but the scrolls as well, you don't know what they are until you use them. That includes identification scrolls. So, basically, when you pick up an item, you don't know what it is. You just gotta use it. And then the next time you find the same item of that type, you'll know what it is. And they start off, they, they show up as colors, like blue scroll, yellow scroll, but the colors switch the next the next time you play the game. So you can't just remember, oh, blue means healing. No, it doesn't work that way. Um, and there are negative effect scrolls. There's ones where it confuses you, makes you run around in a circle, ones where it slows you down, ones where it makes you, oh God, hellhounds. Fuck, are there more? That, that thing didn't really hurt me that much. It's because you shielded, I'm telling you. Your shielding really help, helped you that much? God, I had hellhounds. Ah, fuck. Ow, fuck. That hurt me. That did hurt. I'm no longer... Oh, I leveled up! <gasps> Sickness! Okay, four points. Uh, well, obviously endurance. Yeah. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. It is showing your endurance without your extra items. Oh shit, uh, so, that's fine, you, you got the helmet, uh, and something else. You got two things that give you endurance. So if you do, if you put four points of endurance, you'll be at exactly 100. Sure. One way to find out. Start the game. You know, different slot, <laughs> of course. Shame I couldn't save the game before actually doing the level up process. Well, you can't have everything, can you? Show me. Oh, you just walked past it. Alright, so you're at 100. Yeah, that's good. If I take that off... Yeah, perfect. Perfect. So now... Did you wanna... Did you wanna, l like, level up endurance on another 10 points so you could take the helmet off? Didn't we talk about doing that? Well, here's the thing. We did talk about doing that, yeah. Uh, but then you were going to put this willpower guy on. 
But why don't I just level up willpower? Like it's the same. Like it's well, no, it's actually better to do it this way because if you do it that way, like let's say you're leveling up ten more points to endurance, right? So you can take the helmet off and wear the willpower. That means you can do one of two things. You can wear the helmet, put points in, and have those, like, until you actually get the 10 points, have just points used but not actually having any effect on your character. Or you can take the helmet off now and lose 10 endurance. But gain an extra 10 willpower. I will... Because Hellhounds are pretty badass. They're, they're ripping me a new one. If I put the willpower on now, so I'll, I'll go down to 90, and then that'll pop up to almost 70. And then I can either level up endurance or... Yeah, I should I should switch to... The, I should switch to helmet now. I think we should switch to helmet now. I honestly think you should just go ahead and switch... Switch it. Yeah? Like this? Yeah. Because then, see, like, you'll be a little less powerful in the endurance department, but you, you, you're pretty goddamn beefy, dude. Yeah, like, skeletons and zombies and shit, they don't touch you. But those hellhounds, they rip you a new one. So let's bolster our magic defense. Okay, done. And then, what, from now on, we'll, we'll, level up, we'll continue leveling up willpower? I would like to, before, I'm going to save, but yeah, I would like to, um, before we sell this, um, helmet in the next town, I would like to try wearing the helmet, and just running into enemies, well, let's do it now, let's do it now, okay, because I, well, here's what I want to do, I want to, I want to wear the endurance, have 100 endurance, and see if that actually makes me just invulnerable to physical damage, because the way that it's explained in the manual for this game, is that 50 me like like the max is 100 right but 50 it's more like a percentage than than actual stat points because if you've got 50 it means that you are as strong or stronger than 50 percent of the enemies of the monsters in the world and you are 50 percent you're weaker than 50 percent of the monsters of the world so if i'm 100 that means that i'm Wait, did I max out strength? Yes, you idiot. Oh, what are you looking at? I'm looking at all the stuff, don't worry about it. Um, that means that I am now physically stronger than everyone in the game. But that, that doesn't mean that that negates all damage. You're not invulnerable tank. I'll say, we'll find out. Let's have a look. We, 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 can, we can actually do a couple of tests with the helmet, without the helmet. To see what kind of difference it does in terms of damage taken by like skeletons and stuff, and uh, and then go well yeah it's not that big of a difference. So switch the, to the wheel willpower helmet, and yeah from now on we'll level up. Um, there's an enemy, enemy nearby, so I'm gonna save, uh, and we'll level up willpower because there's not much point in leveling up uh, uh, endurance anymore anyway. I feel like I'm being attacked right now. I am. Hey, Orc. Yeah, attack me, will you? Oh, he's hurting me. He is hurting me. Look at he's, he's not, like, doing a lot of damage. Alright, now let's, um... Let's take the helmet off. Just a willpower. Well, I want the armor ready. That's true. I mean, yeah, it's when he hits me, which is almost never. It is doing more damage, but you know, it's I can, I've got so much strength that I kill them in one hit. So, yeah, let's uh, let's switch to willpower. Alrighty, loading. Uh, what are you doing? Sorry, switching to willpower. I mean, I'm only switching to willpower in this particular instance. Because I know there's hellhounds around. And I don't want to deal with that shit. Hellhounds are the bane of my existence. They really are. 
Man, I wish I had a light. Yeah. Oh, hello. Oh, yeah. We are in level two. Should have known there'd be levels. There's always levels, dude. What are you doing? Sorry. <laughs> For some reason, I thought it was a new level, so I'd start at one again. Idiot. This, uh, oh. Who's that guy? It's a dead guy. Speaking of that potion, do you want to use it? No. You dropped that claim on it. Use this piece of shit. It doesn't say what it is. It shouldn't. No, it's just a... And that takes up... I know, I know it does. Shut up. Takes up inventory, I know. Okay, it's really dark. Oh, hello, that's okay. That I can open. Uh, hello? It's really dark. I feel like, I feel like I'm playing Spookies now. <laughs> I feel like a cute scare's gonna pop out. You know what? The, um... The graphics are fairly similar. It's not, like, as simplified. Oh, I, I thought that was I thought that was an enemy. What's in here? Let's have a look. Hello. Sorry, I'm I'm kind of lost. Can someone point me in the right direction? Try to find. Oh, hello. Who are you? You're like a bald little finger from Game of Thrones. Look anything like Game of Thrones guy. Game of Thrones guy. Or oh, Dark Tanner. A monk, huh? So why exactly was a monk attacking me? You wanna know why a monk was attacking you? Didn't the major skill say? I oh, know, did they? Pretty sure they did. I'm gonna use that potion now. In case it's a healing. What if it's something else? Well, we'll find out what it is. Don't you don't you just use it? Oh, I'm an idiot. Did you do, good sir? Did you do? You just you simply use it. What did that do? I haven't got a fucking glow what that did. Apparently did all of nothing. So these are, seem to be some kind of dungeons, but eh. Oh that's a black wall. Eh. So what is black wall oh way to make the game like like even oh fuck I wanna be careful Is he he's he, he's physically attacking me right well it's hard to say he's a monk he could be like casting some kind of a uh, simple I'm gonna use some uh, healing charges gotta use him use him or lose him so what I want to save, that's not what I wanted to do. I want to press escape, save, click. There you go. There you go, bubba. Okay, okay. We'll get ahead of ourselves. Alrighty, where are we? Who the fuck knows? But this is... There's a rabbit one, alright. There is a gate here, though. So our map is going to be our freaking friend. See how quick that fucking orc died? I got owned. Yeah, orcs are chumps. Well, they are in this game. Oh! Hey, Mr. Skelly. How's life treating you? Let's go. Like I'm trying to. Oh, hello. Someone's attacking me. Quick, back yourself into a corner. Maybe that was just the gate closing. Oh, there's an enemy. I have no idea where I am. This is... Excuse me, orc. Oh, look, another potion. It's a lot of these orcs giving me potions that I don't know what they do. Now, I think in this game, unlike Fatal Labyrinth, even if you've used the potion, I don't think it, future pickups will tell you what it is. Oh, hello. I love the blood. I love the blood you get from orcs. It is... Oh, you're back at the beginning. Great, let's go this way then. Is this where I started? I don't remember starting with black walls. Oh! I mean, right near. Yeah, this is nowhere near as scary as Spookies now that I think about it. No. 
Like, I gotta get, whoa, whoa that's the thing, but then, uh, there's, well, spookies, nothing hurts you. Um, no, that is not true. That is not true and you know it. Oh, uh, yeah. But I mean, oh, what is that? It's a bad thing. Oh, there's a sleepy hole, hidey hole. What time is it, by the way? Oh, it's midnight. Bit of time to take a break. Let's just sleep here. Why are you, oh god, if you can, can you, oh. What's that? Is that it? Is that the... That's just an artifact, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, oh hello. I'll take all that. Yeah, I know, I know we're out of time. Shut up. I just want to see what we got here. Just want to see what we got. Picked up a bracelet. Plus that a personality. Well, I don't need it, but it'll be worth a pretty penny. Did I pick something else up? Did I pick up three things? Yeah, you picked up money. Oh, really? Yeah, that's right. Okay. Well, I'm gonna... I, I need to see if I can get myself on this bed. Because I want to I wanna sleep tomorrow and heal up. No, you can't. There's no way. Alright, give it up. Alright. Start the game. And we come back tomorrow. We will uh, play some more. But for now, my name is Leo, and I will see you next time.